how are you today i hope you're well it's been a long minute i hope you're keeping well i am doing good it's a wednesday morning i'm just about to go out for a run um i feel like i need to go back i went running is it last week last week and i just felt like yes that's something that i've been missing uh to do so yeah i'm heading out now so i'll come back and yeah when i come back i'm making a quick smoothie i'm gonna share with you what i'm making and then i have to go into work so yeah very simple outfit uh, i do need to get new new trainers i have these under armors that i've had for for so long and i keep saying that I'm, well not that i keep saying but i can find something really i've gone to a few shoe shops and i can't find anything but i hope something will come up soon anyway i better go because i don't want to get late coming back and having so guys i'm finally back from my run as you can see from my face it's like well sweated and yeah i did 10 9.5 k i cannot believe that i actually did that today last week i did 4k and you know it's the route that i took normally when i take that it's like i'm just like going on a loop and i don't want to kind of take it take it easy so i just normally just do the whole loop and it takes so long but it's so good and then it gets really really tough when you when you're coming back because it's all uphill imagine you've gone all downhill for like um eight kilometers and then like the last kilometer is all uphill you're like oh my goodness and i had to really uh move like i wasn't gonna walk walk it because i need to come have a shower and make my sm smoothie and head into work so yeah but that felt really really good um i definitely do need to get new shoes so guys please put down your recommendations which are the best running shoes i tell you what these shoes which are under armor i've had them for years and years and they've definitely done their miles like they're definitely on their retirement on their last thread so they i definitely need to change up i have um one second i have these nike shoes they are not comfortable they're not ideal for running because uh so they're quite high at the back and then at the bottom here at the front they're kind of not they they are slanted so you find that your leg tends to get tired at the not the, at the heel at the what do you call that part at the balls of your foot so they get really really i find that i get really tired i got them when i was going for a 10k uh competition run and i struggled that day with them so yeah i definitely need something more looking like that that is probably more flat you know uh so yeah leave your recommendation quick smoothie i left some fruits here uh these are mixed berries i might add a beetroot let me put you down So I'm going taking this. This is my multivitamin that I take. It's the source of life gold liquid. It has so many uh, ingredients inside and they're all natural ingredients and it's super good. Uh, so whenever um, I feel like I need it, uh, I take I normally just take one uh, soup spoon. 
and this just gives me what I need for the day. Um, my smoothie is done. I'm tempted to add in some <laughs> peanut butter. Let me see how it tastes. Oh, that is so good. Oh, does it need peanut butter? I'm gonna give it a try. We'll do a tablespoon. I'm not sure how it's gonna be. Just in case you're wondering, I'm using a ninja, uh, ninja smoothie maker, and this is the thousand watt. This thing is amazing. It's so strong. Um, so yeah, that's me done. Let's taste this again. It looks really good. OMG, that is amazing! Oh wow, how did I put it? But I remember that. Berries, mixed berries, beetroot, half a banana, uh, coconut, uh, no, uh, coconut and rice milk, yogurt, uh, protein, pow protein powder, and uh, peanut butter. That is amazing and that's uh that's what it looks like <laughs> i don't want to pour it anyway guys i'm gonna talk to you again later i have to run i need a five minute shower and out the door i need to be in work by half ten ready to go uh, what is something is okay I'm ready to go I this is the outfit of the day I've decided to put on this little cute green and different colors kind of skirt it has three layers and I've just paired it with this uh, mesh top from Zara and I have two of them I have a beige one and I have this one and then I've just put on um, a small kind of bralette I think that's what you call them but they are cropped so a little bit of my skin is showing and i love that looks really nice the sun is coming out as well so i think it's gonna be warm and i have no makeup i haven't been wearing makeup and i just have my sun cream and the perfume today is beautiful angel i don't know who is this by so that's the perfume that i'm wearing today it smells really nice actually it smells so so floral yeah um it's an out perfume i got this in tk max uh a couple of months ago maybe last year so yeah i am going to head out now i will talk to you again later have a good day guys um i'm just gonna put on something inside because i find if i don't wear anything inside as in terms of kind of biker shots or things like that i am sweating so bad so i have these ones I think that's what I'm gonna wear. They're not too bad. Hair is in a bun, a small bun. I'm going to have my hair braided tomorrow, so I don't have to think about it. And it has so much growth at the moment, uh, but I still have to comb it because if you don't comb it, it's gonna be even harder to comb it. So, yeah, I just comb it. I put it at the back there with a little uh, band, and I will talk to you again later. Have a good day. Bye. So what's up guys? It's evening. It's the evening. I've just come back from work. Now I wanted to tell you, you know what? It's one of those days we decided to go for a takeaway. So we went for I bought Lana and I got one second, let me put you down. I just need to kind of warm them up a bit. I need to wash my hands first actually. One second. I 
I'm actually super tired from I think from this morning after running so I got brown rice I normally go for brown rice I might actually not eat it and for my husband he has the noodles these things are still hot so that's how the noodles look like should close it until we're ready to eat and then my brown rice is just a simple little pot of brown rice so it looks like close it again and then let's see oh. so my husband got a crispy sweet chili chicken it smells really nice it looks really nice as well so that's what we got and I got a uh, green Thai curry so that's what it looks like um, I love the smell of it so yeah all that was 27 euros let's go eat now it's time to eat talk to you in a little while I think we don't need to warm it up good it's a what day it's a Thursday uh, it's my day off most of my videos actually are filmed on Thursday if I'm doing things around the house or outside or things like that or Monday Mondays normally I don't pick up the camera because I just I'm busy just doing other bits and pieces um, yeah I hope you're well so my morning has started so good the weather was amazing it was like super sunny it was so sunny this morning and then within an hour it's all kind of disappeared unfortunately um, but I've started really really pretty productive and I feel so good I hoovered I did my bathroom I mopped my floor well and then under here is a, a hair that is being treated I have a hair appointment today actually that's why I was actually picking up the camera I got these hair um, what do you call them extensions uh, bundles I got three bundles with a with a, a closure let me put it down because I seem to be shaking. Um, yeah, I was saying I got these hair extensions in Amazon on Amazon.de. Uh, I can't remember the name of the the brand. I might actually find it. I think it's U Uvida. That's the name. Uh, I don't know how it's going to be, but I got a curly one this time, and I got three bundles. I got 16, 14, and well, I don't know what they are now at the moment because what I did, uh, so it's 16, 14 and 12 inches and then a 12 inch closure. So that's how it looks like. It does look quite thin. So I don't know. We'll see. But sometimes they do kind of fill up after the, the hair has been uh, placed in the head and the, the bundles don't look that big either. But anyway, we'll see. Um, so yeah, I got those, I got, I made a mistake and I ended up getting, um, um, dark, like super dark, but I think it will, it will be fine. So yeah, I have, I am treating my hair. I'll actually show you what I'm using as a treatment today. Pantan Pro slash V, uh, intensive mask. Uh, it's a repair and protect. This is what I I actually just got it from the attic maybe over the week, last weekend, last two weekends ago, because I do treatments quite quite often on my hair. And then another one that I mixed it with because it was coming to an end was this function of Yasmina. So this one I was gift, gifted as a gift last year for my birthday, and the person who gifted it for me, her name is Yas Yasmina, because I have um, uh, last year I had a lot of color I put on color on my hair actually I did blonde and so I didn't know that you're actually supposed to use certain shampoos and conditioners so and hair treatment so she gifted me the the whole set shampoo conditioner and this on the hair mask it's amazing it smells really really nice I love the smell of it it smells like tea actually uh, so yeah that's what I've used on my hair and then I just put on um what did I put on? Um, a hair cup, and I'm just gonna leave it there for a while. Um, oh, and I wanted to show you guys. They bought another plant. Someone bought a plant. <laughs> 
yeah i'm obsessed i saw them and i was like i have to get it um i just left it in my shower but i got a monster the other day and yeah i watered it and this thing was 12 euros and it's huge 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 uh so yeah i saw it and i was like oh, i'm gonna get it so i got a hydrangea um yeah these ones they are beautiful this one was i think 11 as well this was 13 euros so that was 13 euros i got that because i have that one over there and i have another one over there similar exactly the same and i have this massive one the most beautiful hydrangea like come on it is stunning it is so big it's happy um yeah and i got them all in the same shop i got them in aldi i don't know how long ago i got this i feel like i got it last year um but yeah it's one of a happy plant um yeah so that's what i got i got two plants I so i am finally showered and just washed my hair blow dried it and um i put in a leave-in conditioner as you can see that my hair still has color in it and that's why i was still i'm still using the function no function yeah the function hair products because yeah because of the color until it kind of all grows out i have a lot and a lot of growth um the last time i washed my hair i actually did it blow dried and every single day was a struggle for me to to comb my hair but yeah so i washed it i deep conditioned and i used that's what i use as my leave-in conditioner the blue magic originals i'm just gonna put it a little bit at the at the ends and i am dressed i wore this bodycon kind of dress i got this in pennies i think last year and i've never worn it and because i'm at home i decided i'm gonna put it on today it's quite comfortable um yeah so that's me i'm just wearing some sandals simple sandals um, i'm gonna this is the perfume that i'm wearing i actually still do put on perfume whenever i'm at home um you can see because it's it's kind of rubbed off even when i bought it it was like that it's the beautiful angel and it smells really nice it smells like one of them anyway yeah i'm gonna sit down now and start my editing i will talk to you again later yeah my hair has grown so long when i start when i started uh retouching it while i fast oh my goodness i can't speak when i first um did hair relax on it it was so short it was like this much of it i could hold from you know this little length here that's how much i was able to hold it but now i can have a proper proper little um i can hold my hair back anyway uh yeah let me stop rumbling i'm gonna talk to you again later it's turning out beautiful actually uh but i don't want to go anywhere because i know i have a busy weekend coming on so yeah talk of growth growth My goodness it's so dark so guys finished editing i feel so good uh i am ready to go i just put on these black um trousers uh the material trousers uh they have these kind of silver detailing their zipper there's no pocket there but and this uh kind of cropped little white jumper is it a jumper something anyway just something uh to keep it's a bit it feels cold actually so yeah i am about to go and do my hair now my appointment is at six it's 4 20 now i have a 30 35 minutes drive so yeah i will see you again later actually i wanted to share with you the um, the bag the bra the company that i got my hair from so yeah that's what i have your vida hair 100 percent virgin hair and yeah but yeah but do talk to you later now what's up guys how are you uh happy friday nifurahi day today it's friday morning just about to head into work and yes my hair is finally done it is beautiful 
um, this is what I got done I got a sew in yesterday evening um, and that's how it looks so I got a 16 inch 14 and a 12 so um, might have maybe two I don't know how can I do it let's see so yeah that's what it looks like it's stunning the only problem I have is the this here the closure it's so um, there isn't much hair there so you're kind of trying to gather hairs from everywhere else to kind of cover it up but the hair feels nice and soft so far hasn't noticed a lot of shedding so uh, one second yeah I haven't noticed a lot of shedding so I hope it kind of lasts a little bit uh, but yeah I, I'm just about to head into work I thought I'll share with you before I, uh, I go uh, I've just put on a very simple um, what is foundation Milani foundation it's a pressed powder foundation and then these lovely earrings I just did my eyebrows I wasn't even gonna do anything but then I was like I have new hair new let me just put on a little bit of makeup to make a, uh, to have a little bit of a difference um, I worked out this morning ever slightly like I think I did 30 minutes the workout was meant to be 40 minutes but I had no energy whatsoever uh, and then I felt really really hot so I said you know what let me just leave I've already cooked dinner because I'm finishing work a bit late today but yeah that's me ready to go outfit of the day I'm wearing this uh, kind of cropped top shirt it's an orange and white checked uh, shirt I love it I got this actually it's pretty new I got this in uh, pennies two weeks ago and I just love the color I love orange sometimes I think I go in in, in moods and so I'm wearing some orange earrings as well and then I just decided to pair it with a skirt um, it is still quite warm and yeah I just thought I'll pair it like that excuse the mat behind me that was my workout mat and then I'm gonna put on some sneakers and I think I'm ready to go I'm gonna wear white ones so yeah perfume I'm still wearing the same I still wore the beautiful angel uh, yeah that's what I wore it's not really nice and yeah I'm ready to go I feel so hot I am roasting but it's gonna be a good day uh, yeah I just wanted to share with you the hair how it turned out it looks so beautiful it is soft it's good to always have new hairstyle once in a while so yeah unfortunately I can't let it down I have to hold it because of work so yeah it has to go back in my rubber band have a good day guys talk to you later god bless what's up guys happy sunday yes it's sunday morning i'm just i was just doing my eyebrows and then i was fixing this um my weave and the lady who did my hair what she did is that she put um kind of similar skin tone color foundation on the what do you call it uh on the closure but she did it only half so there was half brown and half white so what I just did, um, which I feel kind of bad that I didn't share with you, I used the Elor Cosmetic London Elor, I think that's how you say it. Uh, that. So I use these two shades here. So this is the more creamy uh, side, and this is the powdery. And I just applied it like deep in there, and you can't really tell now, because um, what I tend to I find that I get very uh, conscious of the lace being so visible but now it's hiding so well so um, I'm just taking a little bit of the powder with a with a brush and just uh, dabbing in here where the closure kind of finishes uh, so that it kind of blends in so you can see you can barely see it now and then there was this part as well this one here was so visible it was so white actually I don't know so anyway just dabbing that in to kind of blend it to the color of my hair because my hair is quite dark the closure starts ever slightly past where the hair is so you can see my hair is here and this is what I'm doing this is my morning and anyway, I'm getting ready to uh, we have we're going to visit my parents-in-law today it's my mother-in-law's birthday actually today and uh, yeah I'm just gonna do a quick makeup I'm sitting on the side because my blinds the sun is the, just setting here well I don't know what it's setting but it's just here on my forehead so I'm kind of moving on the side ever slightly 
um, just to to avoid getting the beam on my face or the lines. Anyway, um, yeah, I've started by. Um, I can tell you a secret, guys. I don't wash my face most of the time in the morning, especially if I did like a proper skincare in the evening. So what I do is I just spritz a uh, kind of refreshing spritz that I have in my bathroom. And then I just leave my face because I'll be coming to wash it anyway in the evening. Uh, so normally I don't really bother that much trying to wash it off. Um, and yeah, my skin has really gotten so much better. Because um, what happens is that when you wash your face too much, it tends to dry it. And there's just so much, just so much that is going on. Anyway, I'm trying to figure out whether to wear a foundation or just wear a powder. I think I'm going to wear a foundation foundation powder because it's so hot it's humid um, I don't think that's quite light for my skin so I think I'm gonna go for Milano uh, Milani sorry not Milano um, powder you know what I've started by doing actually make our work easier just putting on a powder everywhere oh forgot I just forgot forgot to put a you know what? No, I have to. I have to wear sun cream. I have to wear sun cream because I'm going outside. Actually, I'll be outdoors today. I have to. So this is my go-to. Um, what do you call it? Sun cream, Dermalogica. And this thing when I bought it was thirty euros. It's gone to fifty euros now. It's so good, but. Things are changing. How can something go from 30 euros to 50 euros in less than three months? Like, seriously. What do they think people are getting money to... <laughs> to waste or... guys I am all set and ready to go excuse it's actually quite dark I always find myself in this situation every single time anyway I am ready to go my makeup is done as you've seen I have decided to put on this long pleated skirt and this is from Zara and it has yellow green black gold going into it like it's so so beautiful and I just paired it with this uh, green kind of 
t-shirt situation uh, this t-shirt is uh, silk at the back and then just cotton at the front I just love it it's beautiful I thought it's a nice easy wear on a sunny day like today especially on a hot day cotton is good well linen will be better but cotton is even better uh, on sunny days so that I'm not too sweaty and yeah I love it I think I'm just gonna wear very simple slippers uh, to just complement that I am wearing Mac Jacobs perfect Mac Jacobs intense that's what I'm wearing today and for my lips I've decided to go for one second let's zoom this around so that's how my lips look like I am wearing Deborah I think that's Deborah yes Milano and the lip liner is by Essence and this is shade what uh, melt your heart I think so and just one another brown lip lips lip liner just a brown one just to line um, on the outer of my lips but that's my makeup just put on this beautiful uh, earrings as well this ones I got in Portugal and my hair I just added a little bit of oil argan oil onto it just to give it a little bit so my, sorry my battery just died on me anyway i was saying other than that i will see you again later i'm gonna try and film a little bit of the place where we're going to it's like an animal um it's an outdoor activity that is going on there'll be an animal show different activities probably tractors i'm not sure but anyway talk to you again later um so we are stuck in traffic ever slightly well not ever slightly you can see it's all the way to there we're going to uh limerick show so there's different activities that are gonna be happening and we just happened to take their one of the worst turns so well if we were here probably an hour earlier i feel like maybe it wouldn't have been that bad I think it would, have been fine. would have been fine but yeah i suppose we're gonna suffer it and just wait so our plan is to go and park at uh, our parents my parents in laws and then walk because if we try and drive there and try and find parking maybe we won't find parking so yeah um, and I'm getting tired man it's getting really tired oh my goodness how do these people do it anyway uh, we'll bring you along with me uh, hopefully it's gonna be interesting I've never been to anything like this so yeah maybe a lot of food and animals and peoples Horses and dogs. Oh, horses and dogs. I think for me, my most one that I want to see is the dogs. Maybe horses will be... I think we've missed the horse show at this stage. No, I've just seen few horse going. Few cars with the horses. There's a car in front of us with a horse. So, maybe... Maybe they've missed it too. Hopefully not. So, yeah. <sighs> yeah, anyway, let's... You know, the traffic did start at a, at a day, so... Excuse.